They were there to watch a horse show sanctioned by the Georgia Western Show Association. There were riders from 8 to 50 years of age competing in 35 different classes. At stake was a little bit of prize money and a lot of pride in having your horse take home a ribbon, preferably a blue one. There were a lot of expert judges of horse flesh on hand, including one man who got on one in 1949 and has been famous ever since. Lots of the kids sort of forgot about the show in hopes of obtaining his autograph. Legend has it that he was once a member of the Texas Rangers. Knowing a story when I see one, I wanted to find out what he thought of the Jeff Burroughs deal between the Rangers and the Braves. In the ring, the rodeo queen was displaying her expertise and her talents. But I was still hot on my story. The former ranger said the only brave he knew was one called Tano. I remembered the name. Uh, he used to scout for the Indians, I think. Back in the ring, they were bestowing the prizes. Ribbons were awarded in both English and Western, along with barrel racing, flag racing, and many other classes. Finally, at long last, I got to the front of the line and my story. To my surprise, he said he never played for the Texas Rangers. He only worked for them. I didn't really understand the distinction.